forecast first on Color 10 News, Ozarks First. Good morning. Thanks for joining us on this. Friday. We've got some sunshine out there in Branson. It is 39 degrees on a west wing. You can see a couple of clouds out there filtering through, but they're moving west and trying to move out. We had mostly cloudy skies this morning. They're starting to clear. We're going to get more sunshine by the end of the day today. It's 41 in Springfield, 39 in Rawat, 40 in Mountain Grove this morning. We have a west wind pretty steady, about 5 to 15 miles per hour. We'll continue to see the steady west wind as we head through the day today. When you go to pick up the kids from school, we mostly sunny, a seasonal, a very nice December day with mostly sunny skies and a high of 46. Some things that we need to cover in weather in a few minutes. Elevated fire risk tomorrow and update on the drought. Finally, some rain. All those details in a few minutes. Color 10 News Midday starts right now. Now from Ozarks First, you're watching Color 10 News Midday. Good morning, everyone. Welcome on into Midday. I'm Joe Morano. And in an interview that Color 10 had for you yesterday, the man at the center of an email controversy is finally breaking his silence. Green County Commissioner Bob Certain reveals what he really meant in an email that seemed to suggest public funds be used to advocate for a half cent sales tax, along with urging county employees to campaign for the ballot measure on company time. He says that the emails shouldn't be taken at face value and that nothing he said or did related to the ballot issue was illegal or unethical. While he acknowledges the wording of the emails is controversial, he stands by the email content. He believes that the investigation going on will ultimately clear him of any wrongdoing. As far as the, the content,